Nothing that I've seen or heard from Paul Haig over the last 30 years gives me any confidence that he's reformed himself. I think he's a psychopath and um, is not capable of re-entering society. And I think he gave up his right to ever come back into society. When you murder a nine-year-old child in front of their mother, when you stab someone 157 times and then have sex with them after they die, that person's not human, in my view. And every time his name comes up into the papers, it just, here we go again, it just re-traumatises everyone. I wish he would just accept what he's done. And I believe he, some years ago, tried to contact you? Yes, he did. About 10 years ago, he sent a message out that he wanted to apologise to my son um, for the death of his father. So I rang the prison and got a message back to him. Um, I don't want his apology, and my son doesn't want his apology. So I, um, it's of no purpose to me. It's not going to change how I feel. Do you think he can change? I don't, no. I don't, I can't reconcile what he did with somebody. I mean, look, I think, I think every one of us are capable of murder given a set, set of circumstances. You know, there's people in jail that might have killed their wives or husbands in a fit of rage. And I think someone like that could, um, could come out back into society and live amongst us. But not what, not what he's done. I just can't, I can't reconcile that. And I don't ever believe that he could.